Hello, this is Henito, and today we are going to be checking out some of the demos from the Wholesome Snack Showcase. So, Distant Bloom, um, Neko's Night Market, and Lot of Nought, all games that I'm really excited about. First, we'll start with Distant Bloom, a game about being an alien on a planet trying to find a new home. Uh, and I think we also might be restoring the planet as well. Anyway, it looks really cool, so let's start. Somewhere at the edge of the universe, a colourless planet covered by dark clouds. Its inhabitants are desperately scouring the skies in search of a new home. Large telescopes peer into space, piercing the veil of galaxies. Cold gas giant, lava planet, barren world. But maybe there, a tiny planet coloured by pleasant greens and blues. Twelve brave altars and a small robot are sent on an exceptionally long journey. Their mission? To build a new home and save the future of the altar species. And that's of course where we come in, crashing. Sleeper, sleeper, wake up. I'm awake, I think. Asleep for 547,500 cycles. Stand up, awakener. Oh. Ah, oh, we seem rested. Help. Is stuck. Oh, hello. Pick up. Hey, little friendo. Little alien robot friendo. Yeah, you're a robot, not an alien. Hey there, bud. Don't be scared. Big thank you, Untrapper. What happened? Error. Memory data incomplete. Are together. Safe now. Yeah, but my cryopod is completely broken. And where is the hearth ship? Detached. My pod detached from the hearth ship? Did it separate during landing? Yes, yes, detached, crashed, trapped. KK. Are you okay? Run diagnostics, diagnostics, diagnostics. I'm trapper nearby, smiley face. KK, protect. Oh, your name is Kiki. Yes, I'm here, don't worry. Can you locate the hearth ship? Triangulation, outside radius. Then we'll have to search for it. The Elder and the others might be in danger. Let's get away before this thing goes boom. Ah, I love it already. It's so cute. What is this? Shiny. Resource raspberry. It looked like a rock, but okay. Whatever you say. What's that sound? Scanner. Accessing mission guidebook. All Elder assistants are provided with standard issue equipment. It includes one backpack, one scanner, one tool belt, and a large portion of positive attitude. Ah, right. I'm sorry. I'm still shaken from the crash. Ooh, scanner. So that's what the scanner picked up. Is it supposed to look like this? Scan? Elongated cloudy herb. It matches a guidebook entry on herbs, but it's dead? Hmm. I love that little skull to indicate that it's dead. That is so cute. Onwards, planet scanner. Another shiny. Yes, Kiki. We're, we're finding lots of shinies. I don't know what we do with them. Do we eat them? Okay, can we jump down here? Yes. 
Oh, we know there's another Rans Barrel over here. I love watching the Wholesome Direct and Wholesome Snack every year. Because uh, there are usually some really cute games on there. What's this junk doing here? Pod crash. Too old and rusty, but no. This planet is supposed to be untouched. Pick. Ooh, why would I pick up someone else's trash? Research. Trash research? Too niche. I need a lab coat for that. Being an assistant is better. But I can hand this over to our actual scientists if they're awake. New resource, scrap metal. We don't seem to be able to scan much at the moment, but I guess it's mainly for plants. Ooh, more trash. Gimme. Thank you. It's funny because one of the other games we're going to be playing, uh, Lodenor, is also about cleaning up trash. Carry? Want me to carry a rock? Why? Why do I want to carry this rock? I don't know. But I'm going to pick up this rock because it's in my way. Ooh, another dead plant. So I guess we can scan that. Did we land on the wrong planet? Accessing last registered coordinates. Mission destination reached. Then why is everything dying? What about this planet? It looks different from the last one. Scan again. Uh, okay, well if I'm supposed to be able to scan, I'm not managing to do so right now. Yeah, because it's not letting me scan this. Oh, it's scanned it. Ah, it's different. It's a different species. Looks like a fern of some sort. I wonder what other types of plants are out there. Okay, so that worked. Was I just doing it wrong? Mars barrel is slightly gooey. I was just doing it wrong. I thought you had to hold space, but you just press. That's my bad. Okay, there we go. We'll put that away for now, since we don't need to scan everything. Another cryopod. Whoever's in inside is still sound asleep. Should we wake them up? Accessing mission guidebook. Follow safety regulations. Only the mission leader may wake up crew members from cryo sleep. I really hope the elder is safe. Otherwise, this altar will be in there for a long time. What? Uh, I personally would just ignore directives and just wake them up anyway. Don't we need help? No more sleep. It is lonely. Sad face. Don't worry, we'll come back for them. We, can we clean up this trash? Tools will be needed to extract this large chunk of metal from the ground. Oh. It's a large pile of trash. Okay. So we'll have to leave that for now. Careful, rock hopper. Don't you worry. All these plants are dead. Dead as doornails. Dead as donos. Ooh, this is a different one. Twisted Oval Tree. Oh, and this is also... These are all big piles of trash. Rock Hopper's Pod. What do you mean? Oh. Could we see it? Oh, we could see it. That's cool. And here's a cave. Which, of course, we're going to go in it. Why not? Uh, metal that you found scattered around. Cool. Scary! Don't worry Kiki, you're with me. We've got our scanner. I'm not going to let anyone take out your batteries. Oh, that's... That's the big trash we can't do. I wonder how we make tools then. Beep beep. What is it? Ah, ship within radius. Ah, oh, you're right. I can see it on my scanner now. This is your compass. It shows points of interest and the time of day. Ooh, cool. Oh. 
Is this a big trash? It looks like big trash. Okay. Discovered fields. Oh, this is the ship. That's cool. Oh my god, quickly, we need to go and see if the Elder is alive. Scan. What is this? Wee! Glowing vine. Okay. So their purpose is just for us to go up and down. Well, that's good. The Elder! Elder, you are awake? Of course I am. A robot could not be in charge of landing the hearth ship. It is a delicate task which I executed flawlessly. What about my cryopod? Why did you eject me? So you meant to detach the cryopods? Detach? <coughs> uh, naturally. Was there anything else? I, w I saw another alters pod. It seemed intact, but locked. Of course, I alone hold the security key to open them, which makes your presence here quite surprising. My pod was damaged. I woke up on the ground and found Kiki trapped by debris. Big oof. Big oof. Oh. I'm... S well, you're here now, and you can start assisting me, assistant. Should we wake up the other altar? All in good time. We need to set up a home base first. As you say, Elder. What did you see on your way here? Uh, place is not what we expected. I found this junk scattered around. We picked up trash from the ground? It's really strange. It looks like it's been here for a long time. Strange how? I have never heard of a plant without trash, have you? No. Speaking of which, I need you to move all this junk out of the way so we can start unpacking. Report back to me when you are done. Oh, tidy up. Pick up scrap metal around the hearth ship. Oh, I see. Wait, there's trash picker. Oh, I had no idea plants looked so pretty. Oh, the plants came to life when we picked up the trash? Ooh. That's cool. Can we scan them? They're alive! Look at the little smiley face. I think that's all I can clean for now. Hey, we cleaned up around the hearth ship. Look how pretty it is. The real question is, how did it become so dirty? Alert, unusual activity. Where? Oh, I can sit. Oh, but I better follow Kiki. Long route. What's that? Scan the route. Oh. This bar shows how many plants you've healed in an area. Keep going. Oh, a bit of life is coming back into this route. Where lead? Inside the cave? Um, I can't really see. We'll need something to cross the ravine. Hmm. Uh, I wish we had our builder to help out. We'll just have to come up with something on our own. But that's for later. The Elder is waiting for us now. Hmm, cool. So as we heal areas, it opens up access to other areas, if I'm gleaning that correctly. Goodness, this place is just not a tad too green. What did you do? What you what what you don't like how pretty it is now? What is wrong with you? Uh, I cleaned up the trash. Cleaned? Did you pick it off the ground again? Yes. You are a strange one. Elsewhere is soon forgotten, as the old saying goes. Now we should wake up Bahan, so they can set up the exonutri processor. I'm getting quite hungry. Was it them I saw in the pod on my way here? Could be. Ask the robot to lead you to them. Oh, I almost forgot. Here, take the cryopod security key. Off you pop, both of you. 
I don't really like the Elder. For one thing, he detached all the pods and crashed the ship. I mean, he didn't crash his own ship, but he crashed the ship that everyone else was in. Pretty much. So steep. Well, we don't have to go up anywhere too steep, so don't worry about it. Down there. Hey. Oof, my back. Wakey wakey. Ah, oh, well, that's a face I wasn't expecting. Did we arrive? Yes, we're on altar three now. Thank goodness. I don't think my bones could have taken one more day in that pod. And the others? Are they well? It's just us for now, but the Elder thinks the others are safe. Psst. And I was looking forward to seeing everyone again. I guess the Elder is waiting for us at the Hearth ship. Let me take my things before we go. What in the name of the Plentiful is this? Hmm? What is this shovel doing in my pod? Did I sleep on this thing the entire journey? No wonder my back is killing me. Oh no. Ha ha, should we laugh or be like, oh no? Oh noos. Who had the groundbreaking idea of storing it in here? Ha ha ha, groundbreaking shovel, right? Go easy. Here, I'll take this off your hands. Yeah, give me the shovel. I want it. Thank you. I don't want to see that thing ever again. Nice, we got the shovel. Can we shovel now? <gasps> we can. Hey. Give me all this trash. The fact that the Elder doesn't like me picking up trash makes me just want to pick it up all the more, to be honest. Man. How good to see you, Elder. I would have naturally come to wake you up myself, but uh, I cannot leave the hearth ship in the, green, in the hands of a greenhorn. No worries, your assistant has been very helpful. Good, then leave it to them to set up your tent. A tent? Wasn't Rhesus supposed to build homes for us? Protocol dictates to set up basic facilities before waking more crew members. Food first, then shelter. Uh, really? Or is it just that you're hungry? Uh, still better than sleeping in the pod. I'll place the tent in a nice spot for you. I appreciate that. We'll be nice to Bahan, because Bahan seems nice to us. Well, as long as I have space for all my flavour capsules. Tell Bahan when you are done. There is more to do next. Yeah, I'm sure you'll always have jobs for me. Place Bahan's tent. It sits in the heart ship. Neatly packed in a box. Okay. Ah. So we'll carry this somewhere nice. Oh, a pre-assigned position. That's fine. There we go. Ah, you're welcome, Bahan. I like you. I don't like the Elder. Your tent awaits you. Alright, let's see it. By the way, the Elder wants us to install the Exonutri processor. Could you carry it from the ship while I unpack my flavour capsules? Uh, sure. Thanks. Yeah, why not? We'll do that now. We're a strong little beast. Nice! I've had my fair share of carrying these things, but my back still hurts and I wouldn't want to drop it. That's a limited series processor, you know. Then they should have made it lighter. Huh, I hear you on that. Now all that's left is to find something to put inside. <gasps> I've got some stuff. How can we know what's safe to eat? Metal scrap. No, alters can't eat that, Kiki. Hmm? Maybe the Elder remembers something. The Great Wilt happened before the time I became a flavour chemist, so I don't know much about organic ingredients. But I'll look around to see if I can find anything. Keep an eye out too. Sure. Elder, do you think we can use plants in the processor? Naturally. You may be too young to remember this, but they used to be added to food. But that was a long time ago. Uh, why do we stop using them? We simply ran out. Most plants on Ultra, Ultra 2 disappeared during the Great Wilt. Of course, but I've never really understood what happened. 
Why did they die? Only the plentiful knows. I have heard similar wilts happen before, yet none so severe. But that was a long time ago. Um, how did you use these ingredients? I'm no flavour chemist, but I assume the way is the same way as we use synthetic ones. Just dump them all in the processor and sprinkle the flavour you want on top. I once met an alter who used to select every ingredient individually. What an eccentric. Yasma, I think their name was. But that was a long time ago. Uh, thank you. All this talking made me even hungrier. Or, oh, can we put my raspberries in them? I don't have any vegetables, apparently. Okay. So we need plants. Can I pick these plants? Give me the plants. Oh, harvest. Yes. Nice. Uh, take all. Yeah. Seeds. Wow, I've never seen one before. Uh, let's take a closer look at it. Tell Bahan I found something. Did I hear my name being mentioned? Come here. Look, I found some seeds. Excellent. I couldn't find anything, but these will do just fine. Now let's get cooking. We're going to eat seeds. Um, make jelly. New food, jelly. Jelly is ready. Well, look at that. We might make a flavour chemist out of you yet. Tiki tastes. Sorry, bud, this is altar food. Aww. Now let us eat. I am starving. Nom nom nom. 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 Ugh, this jelly is disgusting. There's no seasoning. And what happened to the flavour? I didn't want to say anything, but it's gross. The processor's flavour infuser must be damaged. No need to overreact, just fix it. I can't. This line was recalled from the market because of an accident involving a hamster. Exaco couldn't give us any spare parts. Oh, in the name of the plentiful. <clears throat> then we have no choice but to eat the jelly as it is. Elder, with respect, I've had to mix some very questionable flavours in my career, but this is unbearable. On my pride as a flavour chemist, we must do better. Then what are we going to eat? I don't know. I need some time to clear my head. What a mess. What a mess. Elder? Oh, <clears throat> what now? Are you alright? Naturally, why would I not be? This crash landing situation took a toll on us. But we must remain calm and follow protocol. Bahan's dedication to their job is admirable, but knowing them, they will sulk over that jelly for a long time. Can we even eat it if we can't pick the flavour? What else can we do? Eat raw plants? Bah. Perhaps it is time to wake up Racer. Hopefully our reliable builder can repair the processor, or at least talk some sense into Bahan. I updated the data cloud, so now your scanner should pick up the signal of nearby pods. Of course, Elder. I'll go look for Risa right away. Uh, locate the builder's pod. Check your compass. It's pointing southwest. Ooh, okay, cool. I really like this game so far. It seems really cute. I like the mechanics, and the characters are quite funny. So, I'm happy. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Don't worry about it, Kiki. We can uh, we can do this. Look how much scrap metal we're getting. I bet it's going to be useful later. Oh, it's night time as well. Discovered hills. Okay, let's pick this pick this trash up. There we go. Look, do you think it's sturdy enough to walk on? Road bridge. Wait for me. Ooh, harvest. I'll take this back to Bahan so they can cry some more about how disgusting it is. Find a way to reach the pod. Reach the pod. That's right, but it's lodged into the other side of the cliff. 
I don't think we can reach it from here. Let's find another bridge. Ah. Ooh, there we go. <gasps> we created a bridge. Oh, we need to pick up more trash. You know, I've been wondering. I don't really know how plants work, but there's a way to grow them, right? Ask Seed. Um, I don't think they can talk. Can they? Let's put it in the ground instead. You shovel. You shovel, Seed Planter. You to take out your shovel. So scanner, shovel. And then we can dig. And then we can plant. Uh yes, I want to plant this. Nice. Oh, let's see what happens. Oh, when I planted the herb, the other plants grew too. Is that a tree and a fern? Herb, fern, tree, plants grow together. Yes, maybe the plants are like us. Having neighbours makes them happy. I bet the other plants have seeds too. We can harvest some and grow and keep growing with different plants next to each other. To fully grow, a plant needs two neighbours of different types. Hmm. It's true of humans as well. We need lots of different people in our lives. To grow and be more accepting of each other. Imo. Ooh, okay. So wait, what kind of wait, what kind of plant is already here? We need to discern that first, right? So scan. It's a herb. Okay. So if we plant a fern and then we plant a tree. Hey. Yeah. That's really cool. So there's kind of like a slight puzzle element to it then. Oh no, I didn't mean to put a herb there. Hey, there we go. So that was better. Okay, but I've run out of time for playing Distant Bloom, so I think I'm going to move on to another demo. Okay, this is our second wholesome snack demo. Loddle Nought, which is a game about cleaning up trash in the ocean, trash and pollution in the ocean. So again, kind of like Distant Bloom in that way. So we're gonna, it says Gamepad recommended, so we're gonna play with Gamecam. Ooh. Hello, I'm Dave. I'll be your supervisor during your time on GUP14. Oh, hi Dave. How you doing? Your first task is to clean up the pollution in your landing zone. There's a lot of it, so you better get to work. Oh, okay. Ooh. If you have trouble locating nearby pollutants, make sure to use your helmet scanner function. I think I'm good. Also remember to drop off collected litter at the recycle box located next to your ship. Oh, okay. Ooh. Aha, almost missed you, Bottle. Yeah, this is so cute. I love this already. It's just another chill game about cleaning up your environment. Wee! Oh, scan. Oh, I see. It highlights the trash. Get it. Bouge. I love the little shooty noise it seems to make when we uh when we get the trash, that's really cute. Boosh do douche. You're mine, trash. Okay, where is some more trash? How much trash do we have? We have uh ten plus four that says there's fifteen pieces of trash around here. So let's just use our scanning function. Trash. Aha. There you are. Your little... Oh no. Did I just spit out trash? I didn't mean to do that. There you are, your little naughty bottle. Get in my gun. We need to put 15 pieces of trash away. 
Okay, here we are. Uh, deposit item. Ah, here we go. Change, change item, there we go. So we need to put, as in real life, we need to put all our trash in the correct receptacle. There we go. Done. Oh, what did that little guy say? I didn't actually get to read his message, but I'm assuming he told me I can now leave the area. Ooh, what's this? Uh, you have just left an oxygenated zone. You will need to monitor your oxygen from now on. Oh, really? Okay. Be sure to periodically refill your oxygen tank at the floating recharging ring by your landing zone. Oh, okay, so that's what that's for. Well, what's this? This is toxic waste material that we refer to as goop. We use the laser on your bubble gun to neutralize it quickly. Oh, okay. So I can, I can zap it like this. Ooh. Cool. Take that, gunk. Great work. Fully keen plants have increased resistance to goop spread, so make sure you are thorough in your cleaning. Oh, don't you worry about it. I'm going to thoroughly clean up all this goop. Excuse me, goop. Are you trying to hide from me? Get it. There we go. Ooh, ooh. Pow. There we go. Oh no, these little planties are, are goops as well. Give me this. Yeah, there we go. What's that? What's this? Tubi fruit. Please do not attempt to eat that fruit. We don't know what effect it has on humans. So why am I collecting it? I don't know. But it's mine now. It's the present the plant gave me. For cleaning up all the goop. Do you also have presents for me? <gasps> you do? What is this? Coral fruit? Oh no. Give me, give me that back. I keep accidentally dropping my fruit. Give me. This area is known as Ripple Reef. Pollution levels on the planet have made it uninhabitable. Your job is to clean up all the contaminants in the area. I'll be mo here monitoring your progress. Ah, There we go. So as you can see, this is just a really chill little game about cleaning up. So it's not stressful. Well, I assume it's not stressful. Uh, it's not stressful, it's just chill. You're just here cleaning up the goop, cleaning up the trash to make the planet a better place again. There we go. What is this? Trash bag? Oh, oh my god, that had so much trash in it. Give me this fruit. Your suit is running low on oxygen. Please swim through the ring located near your base. Oh no, I completely forgot about that. <gasps> We're on 22% oxygen. Okay, let's go. Let's go. We need we need to hightail it to the oxygen ring. We're run it's running down. It's running down. Quick 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 quick. Did I say this was a no stress game? I was wrong. I mean it's only it's only stressful if you don't keep an eye on your oxygen. Like a sensible human. There we go. Oh my god, we've got so much oxygen now, practically choking on it. This is this is like one of those oddly satisfying things. If you've ever played uh, Power Wash Simulator, you know what I'm talking about. I mean, I find cleaning oddly satisfying in real life as well. Like you come home and you're you're kind of tired, but you see something that he's doing, and then you do it, and you feel really good that you did it, and then you can sit down, have a cup of tea. Play a game and you know just chill out. Something about setting your setting your home in order or your room that is quite relaxing. So if you're putting off cleaning up your desk, if you're putting off hoovering your floor, cleaning up that pile of clothes, I encourage you to do it because you'll feel better. Oh no, I threw my fruit around as per usual. 
I think it's time to cue like a relaxing montage of me like speed cleaning things. Congratulations, Riffle Reef is now adequately clean. I'm sure any native creatures would be happy to live here. Are there going to be creatures now? Oh, that's just a loddle. It looks like it's covered in goop. Can I clean it? Unfortunately, you are not authorised to use your laser on the local wildlife. Not after what happened last time. What happened last time? Best to just ignore it for now. You want me to just ignore the poor little fishy? <gasps> oh my god, I need oxygen. Ugh. Oh my god. Hey little friend, are you following me? I'm sorry, but I've been told that I can't help you right now. So you'll have to just look at someone else, okay? I'm sorry. Quit, quit looking at me, okay? I can't do anything for you. I don't think that doddle will be comfortable anywhere until it's clean. If only it had some other device that could restore it back to health. Yeah, if only. Ooh! Looks like the recharge ring blasted the goop off the doddle. I think you should return it to Ripple Reef now. Okay, but just a second, okay? I've got trash to pay in. Use? What's this? Crafting station purifier bomb. Oh. Uh, yes. Give me that. I could have been using a purifying bomb? My little fishy friend. I could have been using a bomb to clean everything up. Oh my god. I never knew. You recycled enough litter to make to form a material bit. Bits can be deposited at the shipping station in order, to, to, in order to, to order new equipment upgrades. Oh. Gimme. Okay, so what's... Uh, what do I need from my inventory? I need this. Toss all. <gasps> Ooh. That's cool. Gimme this. Got glass bits. Uh, oxygen canister. Oh, I knew we could upgrade. I guess we can't upgrade during the demo, though. Which is fine. Or can we? Oh, we did. We have. Fertilizing station. What is that? Okay, upgrades. Fertilizing canister. Ah, uh, I used up all my stuff accidentally buying this fertilizing station, which I don't even know what it does. What does, what does, what does this do, huh? Place, okay, uh, I guess we'll place it, uh, we'll place it here? What is it? Fertilizing station. Dismantle? Well, I guess we'll take it with us for now. I don't know what it is. Come on, little Loddle. We'll take you back to uh, where you came from. Looks like the Loddle is now comfortable living in this area. Better here than near our precious equipment. Aw, oh, if you say so. I'm gonna miss my little Loddle friend. So what am I missing around here? I must be missing some trash. Uh, so there's our little little friend. Hello, how are you doing? Hold out item? Or can I feed you? Congratulations, Ripple Reef is flourishing. You still have an entire planet to clean. But before you can continue, I must write a report, performance report first. Did I feed you? <gasps> I fed you, you little squish. Do you want to eat that? 
Yeah, you do. I'm sure HQ would like to hear from you. Let me get you the necessary means to contact them. Oh no, that was it? Damn, that was really cool. That was really fun. You've completed all the tasks in the demo, but please feel free to keep playing for as long as you'd like. Ah, Interesting, that level seems to be growing new features with each bite of fruit. Really? Ah, no matter. Do not let the creature distract you from your job. I absolutely will. Eat more fruit, my pretty. Yes, that doll has grown too fond of you. Please scare it away by blinking your helmet lights. Uh, why would I do that with my new little friend? There you go. Do you want to eat that and grow bigger and bigger? So big that you can actually eat me? That'd be funny. Aww. Well, that didn't work. <laughs> it seems to like you even more now. I give up. Play with the doddle all you like. Just please, don't forget about your job. Aww, that is so cute. And with that, I think we've come to the end of the Loddle Nought demo. But it's so cute. You can feed the fish. You can clean up trash. I mean, what more do you want in a game, really? Eh? Yeah. What more could you ask for? Okay, this is the final and last demo from the Wholesome Snack, Mineko's Night Market. I've been watching this game for absolutely ages, and I'm really excited to be able to actually play it. So let's let's not prevaricate, let's get into it. Welcome to the craft store. <gasps> it's you, the new girl in town. Mineko, I believe. Yep, that's me. Yay, I'm going to remember you. My name is Bobbo's mum. Is that your real name? It is. Lucky for me, I ended up having a child named Bobbo. Speaking of whom, Bobbo told me you died out in the woods. But I can see now that you are not dead. Which is much better when you think about it. Hmm, <clears throat> let me show you something. Why don't you go on and take that flower craft bench? I'm a little short on money at the moment. Oh, I meant you can have it. As a gift. She's trying to keep you busy so you don't go and almost die again. Bobbo, nobody dies. Anywho, I bought that flower craft bench for my daughter, Saki, but she had developed other interests. Yeah, she developed a real keen interest in going out late with her friends. Bobbo. Anywho, I'll have the flower craft bench delivered to your house immediately. I saw you just moved into the old house on the western side. Yeah, now we can all stop wondering if anyone will ever move into that weird side of town again. Haha. <laughs> Bobbo. There's something weird about that side of all the people that live on that side of the island. In fact, before you two were born, there were plenty of families that lived there. You know, back when there were actual jobs and the market to look forward to. Where did everyone go? Most people left the island to look for work. But a handful of residents stayed because we just couldn't bear to leave this place. We call those people suckers. Bobbo. Thank you, Mineko. Anywho, go on and check out your new flower craft bench at home when you have a moment. I'd be very excited to see what you make with it. Thank you, uh, Bobbo's mum. Move with WSD or control stick. Well, I'm using a control pad for this. Uh, because I usually find a lot of demos are geared more towards control pad for some reason. I don't know why. But as you can see, very cute. Very cute art style. And it's a crafting sort of game. Unboxing new flower at home. Okay. 
So yeah, it's your usual kind of crafting game. You can collect stuff, plum flower, for example. Um, and yeah, something to do with the night market. But we'll find out as we go along. Hey cat, are you okay over there? Meow. Yes, in cat. The cat is fine. The cat doesn't need any rescuing from the boat. The cat is like, this is where I want to be in my life right now. Which is fine, that's fair enough. Hello person. Hey you, are you into bugs too? Or do you think they're gross? Um, I like bugs. You don't got to be brave around me. I bet you think they're gross. No, I don't. I like bugs. How dare you assume that I'm lying? Oh man, you gotta try Beetle Brand Ramen. Don't be scared, it's just a brand name and does not include actual beetles. Wait, I gotta try Beetle Ramen first. What, you mean you haven't, you have, wait, you're telling me you haven't eaten Beetle Ramen, but you're recommending it to me? That's not how things work, my guy. You here for my autographed? Hattie. I'm gonna be a famous ball player like Speedo Aguru someday. You may doubt me now, but I never said I doubted you. So you think I could be a professional baseball player? Sure. Whoa, this is huge. I need to train hard for my pro career. Someone get me two sports drinks, stats. Stat means fast, I think. You want sports drinks? I don't know if that's gonna help you be a good athlete. You discover the Sakura flower. Ooh, lovely. I thought those usually grew on trees, but okay. We're not going to split hairs about where things grow. This is super cute so far. Excuse me? People in giant lucky cat outfits? Okay. What, who are you? See you at the night market, left cat. On Saturday nights, says the right cat. Okay, that's fine. Talking cats. Oh, money made this week, zero. Best night market, zero. Oh, I see. So this is how much we make when we eventually sell stuff at the night market. Cool. It is so cute, though. I love this art style. Hey, new dude. You into any games? I love games. But there's nothing to do around here. People seem to be into these boximal things lately. You ever seen them? I want to get into boximals, but they're so expensive. If you have an extra boximal blind box, I really want to try opening one. Okay, I have no idea what that is, but sure, I'll keep my ear out. Hey, I like your style. You should be on my show sometime. Uh, you have a show? No. But when I do, you should be on it. I really want to start a show all about food. Ah, oh, well that explains why you've got strawberries for a hair bow. If you ever want to help me get this thing off the ground, come talk to me. We're going to be superstars. I guess the first thing we need is content. I guess if we want to make a show about food, we'll need food. Wow, you're really putting two and two together there. Oh, let's start with a cup of truffle ramen. That should be easy to find in a vending machine around here. Okay, so we're looking for a vending machine. We're looking for a box and all. We're looking for sports drinks. We're already very busy. Is this mine? Mailbox is empty. Okay, so I guess this is my house. Oh no, there's some guy in here. Hey, Wormburger. Looks like you got a delivery in your room. Oh, okay. Who are you? Are you my dad? Oh, TV? Let's all stare at TV. What's happening on the TV? Let's turn the TV to something different then, because that's weird. Baseball, that's boring. Oh, that's all that's on TV? Okay, cool. <gasps> Look at this little pillow! I love this! This little cat pillow that you sit on? That's so cute! That's friggin' adorable! That's just friggin' adorable! I tell ya. Uh, anything in here? No? Okay. What about this? Nifty! Oh! Find four sakura flowers and three plum flowers to craft a cat bouquet. Looks like I have enough flowers to craft a cat bouquet on my flower bench. Flower bench? Sorry. Flower cat bouquet. Craft one? Yes. Uh, hit enter when the arrow is in the green area. Well, I'm on controller, so I'm going to assume you mean press A. 
Yay, I made a perfect cat bouquet. <gasps> That's so cute. I should show this perfect cat bouquet to that nice lady, Bobo's mum at the craft store. This is so cute already. I love it. Sorry, we're still awaiting for our next shipment of... Mineko, you're always welcome here. Were you ever able to figure out how to use that flower craft bench? If you ever make anything with it, I'd love to see. Uh, give one cat bouquet to Bobo's mum. Yes. Can we do that? Oh, uh, you had a chance to try making a cat bouquet yet? Gift the perfect cat bouquet. Of course. Did you make this? Wow, you're a natural at this. I can't wait to see what else you make. You know what? You really should be selling this at the night market every Saturday night. Heck, I would buy more of these from you if you sold them there, especially since we're friends now. <laughs> hmm, I suppose it may be difficult to make more crafts with so few flowers that grow in our village. People used to go out to the gardens to pick flowers, but of course, with the agency investigating throughout the island, bus travel to most areas of the island are restricted right now. Agency? I'm sure you've seen those mysterious folks in suits poking around here and there. No, I haven't. You can tell who they are because nobody wears suits out here. <laughs> uh, any other way to get to the gardens? Unfortunately, they've apparently secured the entire area of the gardens. Such a shame. I hope they're open again soon. We used to visit there every summer. Okay, I better get going. Oh, since you're such a natural at this, let me teach you another recipe. You learned the Kokodama recipe for the flower craft bench. And keep talking and gifting things to various people. You never know what someone can teach you. Thank you so much for stopping by, Mineko. Find a way to get into flower gardens. Okay. So that's our new quest. Yo! Yo, Mineko, can I call you Minex? It's shorter and cooler. Uh, it's literally the same number of letters as Mineko. But it ain't cooler. Anyways, we've got to find a way to get to the flower gardens, or the gardens. I didn't know you had such enthusiasm for flowers. Forget flowers, there's been another sighting of him! Hold on, again with the him? Who the heck are you talking about? Abe, it's Abe! Abe? Yes, Abe, I can't say it any greener. Didn't you ever read the story of Abe before? It's like the oldest story ever. Of course I have, but what the heck are you talking about? Abe is a character from a book. That's what they want you to think. They? Those creepy agents. They're behind this, I know it. There have been sightings here and there around this island for years. But lately, the sightings have been more frequent. Everyone's got their own Abe sighting story now. And now, just by coincidence, these agents begin popping up? Well, you don't gotta be a genius to figure out something smells fishy here. But thankfully, I'm a genius. I skipped grade one. Anyways, there are agents all over the gardens, and I gotta see what they're guarding. If you attempt to enter the gardens, I'm coming with. Take the bus to the gardens? Oh, I see. I'm running around here, and I don't even know where the bus is. Oh my bad, apparently the bus is near my house. I just looked on the map and there was a little bus icon near my house. Here it is, okay. Uh, so there we go, the garden. Uh, new location discovered, village garden. Oh, and there are loads of agents around, I see what they mean. Ah, oh, they've surrounded the place. We gotta find a way in somehow. Um, is it just me, or did you notice these agents seem to have captured cats in cages? What the heck? That's where all the cats are going. Cats are going missing? Yeah, this island used to be full of cats. But recently, they've just been vanishing. Like, around the time these agents started appearing? Yeah, I swear all this junk is connected. Hmm, I might know someone who knows someone who knows something about this. Dude, I'm gonna do some interrogating back home. You gotta free these cats, Minex. 
I thought we were gonna. Are you chickening out on me? No, not even a teensy bit. Being the brains of this operation is work too. I'll catch you at home. I believe in you, Minex. Hmm. Okay, Bobbo. Or Bobs. Oh, it's Bobbo, not Bobs. Fine. Dishes it out, but he can't take it. I got it. Hmm. Thanks, Bobs. Liberate the captured cats. Uh, keep out of the agent's flashlights. If you get caught three times, you'll have to start over. Oh, I see. We're doing stealth now. Ooh! Stay out of our way, kid. Oh, poop. Okay. So, don't run blazing into their flashlights. So, how do I avoid this guy, then? Oh, he's, he's looking away. Go. Okay. We're good. I love the music as well. It's great. Okay, they're looking at the cat currently. Oh, but there's a there's a distraction up here. Uh changed a rock. It didn't distract them. Uh changed to classical. <gasps> they went they went to sleep. Let the cat out. Yeah. Cool. That was pretty funny. I mean, I like classical music, but you know, it's not everyone's cup of tea. Ooh. Oh, go on. Don't flashlight me. Go away. Okay, where's the other cat, huh? <gasps> Here we are. Yeah. Fly, my pretty fly. Okay. Hey, guy. Wee. It's a good thing we're so fast. Okay, where's the, hmm, the suspicious looking agent in that tea house. I better free the rest of the cats before I deal with this. Yeah, that's a good idea. Where are the other cats though? No one over here, so there are three cats left. We, got to be, we just gotta be careful we don't run into any flashlights. Okay, this guy is looking at the cat very, very closely. So we need something to distract him. Oh, looks like the agent is using this tree trunk as his desk. Hmm, okay. Not sure what we can do with that. We'll have to think about that. Is there anything else we can do? Oh, they're patrolling around this cat. Okay. So they're not looking anywhere now. Okay, then they're moving around, moving around, shuffling, shuffling. Fly! Fly, my pretty! Okay. Suckers. Okay, where's the other cat? There must be one more cat down here. Somewhere down here. Those are sleeping agents. They're sleeper agents. <gasps> oh! Cat! Cat liberation! Okay, so he's using this as his desk. So is there anything we can do to upset that? Move, discard. No, we don't do that. Cancel all that. Hmm. Oh, oh, there's a sneak button. <gasps> can we, can we just sneak? Can we just sneak up? Oh, oh. Should we save to examine the tea house now? Okay. Not sure. I mean, I'm a bit confused by that. I don't know if it's because it's a demo or what, but it felt like something should be done with the tree desk. Uh, but I don't know. Anyway, we, we got through it. It was fine. We just need to sneak, apparently. There we go. We cut the power off. Oh! Damn it. Okay. But... We found an artifact. What is this? Okay. Ah, oh, we're wasting our time here. Let's roll out. Yeah, I was going to suggest we roll out. I was already in the process of rolling out before you said. Let's go. Going. Okay. Nice. So we freed all the cats and we found a weird artifact, apparently. 
Agents have left the village garden. You can now use this location to collect flowers. Nice. Cats have returned to the area. Aw. Yes, you can pet them. Well, that's the most important thing. Dude, that was rice balls. You got rid of them all. Everything's working out. Heck yeah, most things are working out. Most. Minex, I've been crunching the numbers. The deeper we get into this mess, the more it seems we're going to need some money. You know. I know. I'm going to be making us the money, right? Hey, you're the one with the night market booth. Keep on crafting and finding stuff to sell at Saturday's night market. It'd be a huge help to our biz. Oh, did you know you can also sell any spare flowers and junk at my mum's craft store too? Now go make us that coin, Minex. And what will you be doing? Hey, being the face of this company is a job too. Peace outies. Okay, so Bob's is useless. Hello. Hello, my little kitty cats. Can I collect your hairballs? Yes, I can. Don't know why I would, but okay. I'll collect your lovely little hairballs. Ooh, and flowers. Too tired to even pick a flower, but not too tired to pick up hairballs. So that's fine. I wonder if we can craft things with hairballs. I mean, it's a bit of a disturbing thought. Oh, you are you coming with? It's a bit of a disturbing thought, but I guess maybe we can craft stuff with furballs. Okay, cool. I think we've got all the furballs in this area. Uh, our little kitty pal is following us. Are you going to follow us home, kitty? Ah, oh, and that was the end of the demo. Well, that was really cool. Uh, very excited for the full game of Mineko's Night Market. It looks... I love it visually. I love everything about it. So yeah, that was three Wholesome Snack demos that were revealed during the Wholesome Snack uh, event. Very, very, very cool. Very, very cool. I think Mineko's Night Market and Lolnaut were my favourites. Uh, but Distant Bloom looks very cool as well. Very cool. They're all really good, all really cute, and all seem like really chill gaming experiences. But yeah, this was really fun. It was really nice to cover some demos again. I haven't done that in a while. Um, if you enjoyed the video, please remember to like, subscribe, and leave a comment. It does help with the channel, and it let me know. It let me know. It let me know that you're enjoying what I do. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you again very soon. In the meantime, take care and stay safe. Bye-bye.